Albert Einstein, perhaps the most iconic scientist ever to live. Known for his wild hair, sharp wit, and groundbreaking ideas that changed the fabric of physics forever, Einstein wasn't just the man who revolutionized science. He was the thinker who dared to redefine how we understand our universe. Einstein was born on March 14, 1879 in Ulm, a small city in the German Empire. From the start, there were whispers about his oddity. As a child, he hardly spoke for the first few years of his life, worrying his parents that something might be wrong. But when he finally did start talking, he dove deep into subjects, asking questions that seemed daunting for a boy his age. This curiosity would come to define his entire existence. This curiosity would come to define his entire existence. His schooling years, however, weren't as luminous as one might imagine. Einstein was fiercely independent, rebelling against the rigid structure of traditional learning. He didn't thrive in the rote memorization-focused classrooms. But his love for mathematics and physics became apparent early on. By the age of 12, he taught himself algebra and Euclidean geometry. He would sit for hours lost in thought, exploring numbers and questions far beyond his years. After leaving school and failing entrance exams to the prestigious Polytechnic in Zurich, Einstein didn't give up. He studied harder, eventually gaining admission and later graduating in 1900 as a teacher of physics and mathematics. But life was never straightforward for him. By 1902, he had taken a modest job at the Swiss Patent Office reviewing technical patents. This wasn't his dream gig, but what it did provide was time. Time for him to think, hypothesize, and eventually write. The year 1905 is often called Einstein's miracle year, a year in which he published not one, but four scientific papers, each of which changed the world. At the center of this revolution was his theory of special relativity, introducing the equation we've all seen echoed in textbooks, movies, and memes alike. E equals mc squared, energy equals mass, times the speed of light squared. With this, Einstein had uncovered the relationship between matter and energy, creating a formula that laid the groundwork for nuclear power and reshaping physics as we knew it. But the man wasn't just a single moment of insight. Over the years, Einstein expanded his work to general relativity, a more complex theory that explained how gravity worked. His concept that massive objects distort the space around them was later proven through experiments by observing light bending around stars. The implications? Everything from understanding black holes to predicting cosmic phenomena came from his vision. His work continues to ripple through science and culture, challenging us to explore and imagine the universe's endless potential. Einstein wasn't just a scientist, he was a thinker, a philosopher, and someone deeply concerned about humanity. As his fame grew, so did his voice in social matters. He moved to the United States in the 1930s, fleeing the rise of Nazism in Germany, a regime that would label his theories as Jewish science out of hatred and prejudice. Settling in Princeton, New Jersey, he continued his work at the Institute for Advanced Study, but his focus shifted. Einstein began advocating for peace, freedom, and global unity. One of his most controversial moments came in 1939, when he co-signed a letter to President Franklin D. Roosevelt, warning that Nazi Germany might develop atomic weapons. While this letter helped accelerate the USS Manhattan Project, Einstein later regretted having indirectly contributed to the creation of weapons of mass destruction. He spent much of his later years promoting disarmament and condemning war, as a person, Einstein was quirky and humble. He often strolled the streets without socks, playing his beloved violin and scribbling thoughts on scraps of paper when inspiration struck. He had a knack for humor, once famously remarking, the difference between genius and stupidity is that genius has its limits. On April 18, 1955, Einstein passed away in Princeton at the age of 76. In his final moments, he declined surgery, saying, I want to go when I want to. It is tasteless to prolong life artificially. I have done my share. It is time to go. I will do it elegantly. But his story doesn't end there. Einstein left behind ideas that continue to ripple through science and culture. From the development of GPS systems that rely on his theories to the concept of time dilation, which challenges our understanding of reality, his work shapes the modern world in ways we can't always see but never forget.
And perhaps that was his greatest gift. Einstein challenged us not simply to accept what we see, but to imagine what could be, to think deeper, to wonder harder. He left behind not just equations and theories, but a legacy of curiosity that will inspire generations to come.